Hey everybody, Dave here. Uh, so, so far we've got our text lock software installed on our server. Now we're going to go through the installation process. Of course, to get to this screen, let me move this up to here. There we go. So you can see my URL bar. We're going to go to the domain we installed it on, forward slash the folder we installed it in, forward slash installer. Okay, and that's how you're going to get here. So now we're going to plug in our database information that we created in the previous video. If TextLock is being hosted on the same server as the database, then this is going to be local host. All one word, no spaces, just like that. Okay, our database user, remember, is ttt321 underscore bobs. Our database name is ttt321 underscore bobs. Whoops, bobs. And our database password was bobs with a capital B, one, two, three. And we're gonna click check. You can see the database was successfully connected, okay? Now you're going to need to plug in some other information. The email, okay? This is going to be the email that gets the text messages. Okay, there can only be one. So set this to whoever is going to get the text messages. I'm going to set it to my email. This will also be the login email for the admin system. Okay, we're going to choose a password. Whoops. We'll make it that, just so we can get it out of the way. And we're going to choose a custom audience name. We're going to call this Bob's Mufflers. Okay. And we're going to click Save. Okay. So now our installation is finished. We've been logged out. Now we can log in. Bob's. One, two, three. and we are successfully logged into our TextLock platform. Now, remember, you're going to see all of these things. That's okay. These are all things that we're going to fill out in the very next video. I'll talk to you soon.